Welcome back to P Pensacore 2, folks. We completed Bug River, which was nice, and we did it in strong fashion, so, and we got some experience on some of our units, so let's continue on and see what the next scenario will be. Germany's, inv Germany's invasion of Norway will stretch the Wehrmacht the Wehrmacht's logistics to the limit. You must decide where to focus the committal of your army. Strategic warning. Isolated and difficult to reach objectives await the southern landing. Extreme mountains terrain awaits the northern landings. Hmm. North or south? So south we have... We'll be invading from Denmark. Which I kind of like since I'm Danish. Up here, and up here we are facing the Brits as well. I think we'll take the south. I think we'll take the south. So we'll be attacking Oslo, I guess. Yeah, let's uh, do Norway south, except. Okay. Let's take Norway. That's going to be fun. Ah, hey, General. There you are. I was talking to my friend Nikolaus, and we have just a new assignment for you. High Command has given the go ahead for Operation Vesselbung, and I want you to take a leading part in this Norwegian excursion. Mm-hmm. Your main target is the capture of Oslo, and heavy cruiser Blücher has been assigned to escort your landing parties to the capital. Simultaneously, you will need to secure major ports along the coast from here to here. Keeping them under our control will go a long way to keeping the British and French out of Norway, and thus preserving our enforcement of Norwegian neutrality. To aid you, we've mobilized additional Falschumjagers. Quite useful for fighting in the mountainous terrain. Infantry will be far more useful than your panzers in this battle. So, I recommend you temporarily put your tanks into reserve for this battle. Now, I know General Falcon Raw's plan might seem a little uh, light on specifics. If you ask me, the plan looks like it was originally some kind of vacation trip. <laughs> Even so, it's your responsibility to get the job done now. I have every confidence in your abilities. Thank you. It irks me a little bit that they say had general because I'm pretty sure that you wouldn't say general if you were German, you would say general. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I am 99% sure that you would say general and not general. So that's a little bit annoying, but if I'm wrong, then uh, please correct me, uh, but I'm pretty sure I'm right. All right, so let's jump in here. Uh, all right, it's clear room for different troops. Use move troops, move to reserve existing ones, okay? All right, Wolfgang Schwarz, ferocious defense. Entrenchment of this unit cannot be ignored. Okay, that's pretty nice. So I think we're going to give that to an infantry unit Actually, it's not that great because we're usually moving, advancing, so we don't really bog down and get extremely entrenched anywhere. But anyway, it's it's uh, it's useful. So tanks are not that great in this one, he said. So that means that I want two heroes. I'm gonna assign you. Close. So let's first reinforce uh, everything that needs to be reinforced, except maybe the tanks, because we don't need to right now. Because we'll put them in the reserves, as he suggested. But we'll see, depends how much prestige we have. We have almost 4,000, so that's pretty good. Uh, but I think we'll do... I 
think we'll do elite replacements. Try and get some uh, some experience on our troops. Elite replace. Elite replace. Elite replace, elite replace, elite replace. Okay, that leaves us with 2,800. Now we have one point available. But if we, let's move you to the reserves, move to reserves, move to reserves, move to reserves. That gives us nine points. Nine points. Now, what we could do is overstrength our fighters a little bit, maybe. Put them up to 12. Yeah. Let's do that. Uh, upgrade. Strength up to 12, upgrade. Uh, then we could. It leaves us with seven. Mm. Hmm. Don't want tanks. Let's just close here. Rivers. There are basically no rivers here. So let's move our Brücken Pyrenees to the reserves as well. That leaves us with eight. How many Falschium Jäger did we get? We got two okay i think two is enough and we have mountains quite significantly up here so i'm thinking a gebirgsjäger might be nice let's get a gebirgsjäger oh i shouldn't have said purchase that leaves us with five we want to get two Gebirgsjäger, or do we want to, because we have... We have one, two, three Wehr Infanterie, one Pioneer, and one Gebirgsjäger. Let's just see. So the Grenadiers are... better except in close defense and they can also move shorter than the Kbiakshaga. Hmm. I'm thinking maybe a grenadier. I'm thinking maybe a grenadier. Leaves us with two points. What can we get for two points? Working Pioneer, not interested. Tanks, not interested. Recon, could be interested. Uh, artillery, not interested. Can't get a fighter. You could get another BF 110. Uh, 
let's see. 14, 6. Hmm. The Junkers. Might not be bad. Carpet bombing, suppressing fire, entrenchment killer. Destroys two points of entrenchment. It's actually not bad. I think I'll get that. Hmm. I'm not sure what I want. It's, it's either the the Messerschmitt or the Junkers. Schmidt is useful because it can finish off almost dead fighters, but doing two entrenchment damage is nice. And there's navy on this as well, so having the 16 naval attack is actually quite nice. We're going with the Junkers. Okay, so that's what we're going with. That's what we're going with. All right, so up here, we'll send in a Capiex Jäger and our Pioneers. Down here, we'll send in a Grenadier and there, I think. Would be nice to have another slot up here for a recon unit. Okay, we'll put a recon there, a recon there, the infantry here. These, I guess, will have to go here. And then our planes will go around here. Okay. That's it. And we have five units in reserve. These guys do need reinforcement really bad. Um, we do have the prestige for it, so let's just do it. It's not too expensive. So let's do that. So that for the next scenario, everything is fully healed in the reserves. Alrighty, we are ready for a fight. Okay, so where do we want to begin? I'm thinking up here. It's raining, so we can't see a damn thing. Oh, uh, we need to end the deployment phase, but we actually don't because we have some heroes to allocate. So we will give you our superior maneuver. And then we will give one of the infantry units Second bear, why not? We'll give the entrenchment guy uh, Wolfgang Schwartz. Okay, let's end the deployment phase. Good, 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 good. What do we see? It's not raining. Good. I am very happy about that. 
Okay, so we have a ship up there. Let's start working on that a bit. And then we have our Gebirgsjäger. We will land here. And our pioneers we will land there. Can we attack? No, we cannot attack. Okay. Fine. Let's send you up this way. Oh, there's a ship there. Let's attack that. Move you in this way. Actually, let's undo that one. No, I want it there. Because in Pentacore 2, you can now, uh, if this guy moves over here and attacks there, our ships will defend, which is kind of nice. Let's send our BFs up this way to take a look. We'll send some fighters with them. Oh, that's not fighters, so let's not send those there. And that's fighters. Actually, let's put the fighters there, because then something can bomb there. Uh, then we will send... Let's do a ship and have a look up here. Doesn't look like there are any ships here. Which is kind of nice. Why don't we take the Junkers? Do a bit of damage to those. And then we have you. Who won one? How come? They have anti-air there. Crap. Can we undo this? No. We'll do it. Ouch. Two we lost. Well, we're going to send our fighters over here as escort. actually. Range three. Two, one, two, three. I can't undo it. Dang it. So we don't want to land anywhere near that thing. here as a screen for that thing. Now the Blucher here, which uh, historically went down in here, and we're, we're going to try and pull back and save. All right, killed three, so there's only two left, nice. Can you embark? Yes, you can. Now, I'd really like to get them up here somewhere. Maybe up here. Uh, but I'm a little bit afraid of enemy fighters. I think we'll send them up here. We're not gonna land in here. There's nothing there. 
What do we have left? You left. I don't want to move you. Sleep one turn. I don't want to move you. Sleep one turn. And that's it for turn one. Let's move on. Ouch. Whoa, there's a sub. <laughs> Jesus, we lost a lot there. This is not good. We'll get up here and land. You get up here and land. We can move in there and take that. Actually, let's move up there. Okay, we can't use our planes, which sucks. This is infantry. And some infantry. Oh, that was recon. Uh, get our... Out of range of that thing, because that thing's nasty. Now, that sub. Right, we took some of it out. Let's move out and try and take that thing out. Okay. That's all the ships done. Now, how do we get these guys landed? Can you move? Yes, you can. Let's move up here. Move down here. And move up here. Actually, you undo that. here then you can land and then our other 15 centimeter can land there all right so all our units have landed good you one one you one two you take that out well, not take it out, but do some damage to it. Okay. We'll only get one suppression. We'll take out two of theirs. So we'll do that. Zero one, we'll do that. Take out that fortification as fast as we can. And then work on this. These guys can't move, so sleep one turn, sleep one turn. You can move up one and sleep one turn. You can stay right there. You need reinforcements next turn. And our air all needs to sleep because we can't do anything with it. Actually, you. Complete replace. And you delete the place so that we're back up to full strength. You just stay there, you just stay there, you just stay there. Actually you if you move over here, then that thing can't hit you. And that's the turn. Oh. 
Oh, you're cut off. You are cut off. Shit. Can you attack that? No. In that case, let's try and find the boat. We didn't. Uh, five casualties there, that's not bad. We can move in and take it. That does mean that we're in range of that fort. Which is not great. Or one. That's not great either. We're completely cut off until we get a supply hex over here. So we need to take one of these things. So I think let's just finish up with the ships for now. Suppose and then Stuka there. Zero one zero one zero one. Alright. Send a fighter over here and strafe. And we'll send you up here, I think. You can't see that it's submerged. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I did not see you there, little friend. But is it worth it? No, it's not. Nice, we took one out. Okay. You sleep one turn. I think we're going to have to come down here and help, and then we can load up again and fly up here. Infantry. Hmm. Crap. I think we'll pull you back because I don't think you're going to leave. And hope that that helps. Can't attack. You can move down here into the forest. Now taking this city would be okay, but we don't get supply out of it. So because we only get supply for the ones with that circle thing in it, so there's no, really no point. So two, finish it off. Check that. Nice. It's down to four, three. Okay. So next turn, that uh, that fort is gone. What's selected right now? 
Oh, there. Three, two. Three, three, nice. Oh, how do you get replacements there? We don't have supply. Huh. Okay, but we'll take it. We'll take it. That's not great. Let's just move up a bit and see. You already did your thing. You already did your thing. You already did your thing. So did you. And that's the turn. So, yeah. Uh... It's going a little bit slow, it feels like, this invasion of Norway. Uh, but hopefully um, things will pick up in the next episode, because we are out of time. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.